G'day everyone, how you going? I'm Crazy Cat Dad. Welcome back to Kamla. Kamla, the Indian horror game that I tried to play last time and my camera screwed up. Um, if you don't really know much about it, uh, basically this woman, who's your wife I think it is, gets enchanted by some demon or something like that and she comes after you and wants to kill everybody and, and all that. And you've got to get her spirit back into the realm or something like that. So, without further ado, I'm going to get straight into it and I'm just going to cut to the good parts because we've already seen half of it so hopefully I'll have the ending for you right soon so nothing new just yet and this game has not scared me in a while um, it's more strategic uh, but is it it is a fantastic horror game so without further ado boom let's go alrighty here we go so we've made it inside the house we had to do a little thing to put a fire out but here we are um, so from memory you have to go and find her um, before she becomes active so I believe she's only in one room as well to find her it's a bit choppy I don't really know why it's a bit choppy all of a sudden but I don't know so there are some puzzles you got to do so while you're getting chased by her and there you go that's her noise is she already active is she already active <laughs> Oh, okay. Why is she active? I don't get it. Why is she active? Wait, what? Is that the end? What's going on? Ah. Quickly do this. Before she hears you. And then you got to get out of here and run and hide. There we go. Okey so for some reason she's already active I don't really know why so there's puzzles we've got to find like a, a teapot sort of thing and I'll, I'll show you in a sec here we go all those things on the side there I've got to find so I'm gonna yeah everyone's seen all this stuff I'm gonna just gonna go straight into it uh, I've got live remaining to collectible seven out of eight okay so it has kept my progress from last time besides what I need to put down okay so okay so this puzzle here I can't remember the sequence, but I did it before <laughs> my camera screwed up last time. She's coming. That sequence of those need to be in coherent with a picture of other elephants and which ways they're facing. Alright. Salt ball. Here we go. That's not good. I'm going to have to hide for a moment. Down the other way, I thought she was already behind me, but she's come from the other room. And every time we play something down, she gets notified that we're there, we need to run. And as we get going further, the less hidey holes we have. And as you can see, we do not have a lot and not a lot of fucking sprint um, in us. It's a shit, but it all adds to the game. You just gotta be smart about where you go and all that sort of stuff. Unfortunately, it just takes time of waiting. And you've got to listen very good, because now I can't really hear her. Right, so we're going to place it down on one of these. It'll give you a sign. This one. And that makes her unhappy, as you can see. She was miles away. The sound actually makes her a bit more paranoid, but I've got to do that for a few more items. Ah, uh, the prayer plate in the same spot as last time. Now you got to be careful. You got things like the bells that you can like run into, and obviously it will be like, "Hey, I'm over here." All right, she's miles away. So that one didn't actually notify. I don't know why, but it didn't. Okay. But she's on her way, so I'm just going to wait to see where she goes. There, here she is. Now, I believe after this next one, this hidey hole that I'm in now disappears. So what we actually got to do is we've got to find a secret to get downstairs. Because then we can run downstairs and separate ourselves that way. Rather than this way. So it, it, it eliminates one, but you're supposed to find a new way. And yeah, yeah. You know what I mean. Alright, so here's one we need the key for. Can't remember where the key actually is. 
We need to get down there. That's our other hidey hole. Right, so that spot there was where up Oh, fucking Jesus! I forgot about that. I'm dead. I'm so dead. I'm dead. Get in! For some reason. Oh, she does get you! She actually does get you. That's the very first time I've got inside there, and she's actually opened up and get it. Usually, as soon as you, like, get in it, and she catches you, like, she goes to catch you, she, uh, <laughs> she doesn't give a shit. Uh, I gotta find the... Here we go. The umbrella unlocks the lock. So I gotta be real careful, because I've only got one live remaining. That's not good. Oh shit. So I was wrong. Coming back this way, I saw the skull that I needed to go back to that way to get under the ground. So I do know that as soon as I pick that up, she comes after you, so I need to make sure that I have enough time to get away from her. She's an ugly looking bloke, isn't she? Excuse me? Oh, for a second I thought the AI changed and she was about to kill me. That's right, so now we just gotta go over and put the, uh, the, the skull down, so I'll, I'll get to that. Unfortunately, she's going the direction that uh, I need to go. And here's where we're gonna put it down. Down, gonna quickly hide just in case. I don't know if she comes back. This is now going to give us another way out. So I was lucky. She did come back this way, but I, I have never seen her actually downstairs. So let's go. Okay, so she's gone around there. My chance to go down. That's new. I don't remember if that happened last time, but that's a hidey hole. I've got to remember that. That's not the right way. Ah, uh, here's the code. So here's what I need. And because it's in Indian, it's got to be different. So that's going to be basically... One, two, three, four. That. So that one's three. So I think it's... I think it's seven... Four, three. That's the code. Seven, four, three. And this is where we got to do the ritual. But that's not till later. First, I'm gonna gotta go up and find out where this code is. I can't remember where I've got to put the code in. Here we go. Now we can get down there. Need the key to unlock. Where would the code be? Can't remember where the code is supposed to be. Right in here. So, I think it was seven, four, three? Seven, five, three. Maybe eight, four, three, or two. Five, six, seven, eight, four, three. Shit. I don't remember. I'm pretty sure because Indian numbers, it's Indian game, is the one with the slash, that means four. I don't know why. So, what is it again? So, and then it had three after it. So, is it six? And then... Ah. Well, that didn't go right. <laughs> totally different. So, I got the prayer book, which is good.
so that's the prayer book done. I'm just gonna sit here because I don't know if she knows where I am. There we go. So I just got what have I got left? I've got the camp whore, the holy water, and the kalash pot. Now I'm pretty sure the kalash pot you get at the ritual. I do have to find a key for there, which I'm not too sure with, but I'm hopefully going to find it. Uh, there's like a loop here that you got a key here. How do I get this opened? I need a bedroom key, so that's right. Not too sure where the key is, but a bit of searching and we'll find it. So there's another hidey hole. This is the kitchen. Now, usually there's something here in the kitchen. Now, I do know if we go backwards, we tend to see a head somewhere poking out as a cheeky thing. But looks like there's no no item here that we actually need, which is not good, but that's okay. And we're back at the start. Phone can go off. Ah, bedroom key. There we go. Alrighty, so what have we got in here? We've got a hidey hole, which is good. And what's that? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Are you serious? Has to be in here. Why would you bring me in here for nothing? Uh What? Oh, here we go. The smudge stick. Ancient piece of cleansing. Now, it's funny about this is as I get closer to where I need to be with these, the more smoky and all that they get, see? How cool is that? Not gonna lie. There's also a bar, and it does block the way you see shit. I'm pretty sure that go in here. Something can be placed here. Ah, uh, see? Ah, uh, okay, so I gotta follow that, which I believe is a ritual now, actually. I'm pretty sure this is for the ritual. Because it didn't make sense that it would, like, all the way I was walking, how it would like all of a sudden disappear with like the bar. So now I've got to find the ritual. I don't know how to find the ritual, but we'll find it. Uh, here we go. It's getting shaky. We're in the red. There we go. The kalash pot. I don't fully get it. Um, also, that hand is like your husband, I think, or you. Someone, someone you know. Anyway, we got the clash pot and we still need to find two more things after. Jeez, they really don't give you much uh, sprint time with this. Are you serious? Why isn't it? Really weird. I couldn't like do it for some reason. Oh, she she can't see me. Okay, so that one is uh, I've got to do with the elephants. Now the elephants, I I can't remember where the elephant pictures are. Right, so there's another item there for me to pick up, and that's to go where I was before, uh, where the elephant, the ritual, place something there. That does something, but I can't remember what. It was sort of like weird and disorientating in some weird way. I don't know. I'll show you guys in a sec. Just to be safe. Close that behind me. Here we go. It does this. And I can't remember what it actually does this for. Not really too sure, but it, we've got to do it. I remember this. So that's the key to get the holy water, so... 
Okay, so there's the elephants there. We're gonna go left, right, down, up. Okay. There we go. And that's how we get the cam full. So we should be pretty good. Pretty sure she's miles away. I remember going black and white though last time. I'm just gonna stay here. Oh, she, oh, she, <laughs> so she doesn't find me here. I don't know why. Really do not why. But I'm happy about it. So now I just gotta go to that cabinet right there and then finish the ritual. Now I'm pretty sure after the ritual it just goes straight into like a cutscene sort of thing. Not 100 percent sure. something hang on what's my, th my objectives I've done that now what do I do I don't remember oh I just gotta push E on it <laughs> here we go enjoy Big stature. Hey, there we go. And we saved it. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. And we forgive all the people she just killed because there was blood and weapons everywhere. Oh, okay. Come la part two coming your way. It looks like the demon has gone to the father. Uh, Mad Mantra Games. There you go. Special thanks to those guys. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, that is Kamla, and that is the, how to finish it and how to play it. Now, my thoughts on this game, it was really, really good. The first start of the game freaked me the hell out. Um, but once I got used to the scares and the sounds, and I actually realized that I had to not just find her and be an idiot and actually use my hearing to find out where she was, um, as well as my uh, my intuition as to how to get around her. Um, made it quite fun, um, but less of a horror game, more of an adventure game and all that sort of stuff. So without further ado, like that was a really, really good game. Like I don't, I, I don't mind it at all. And I actually quite like these puzzle sort of games. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you so much for tuning in. That is how you play Kamla. And that is the finish. And there you go. Let me know what you're thinking down in the comments below and what I should play next. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning in, guys. The next video will be coming your way very, very shortly. I got plenty to come your way. So without further ado, bye-bye.